So we have this secure customer portal. In this website, we need to find the username and password to find our flag. This is the local authority CTF challenge from Pico CTF. So first let's try to log in with the username admin and the password admin. And if I click on login, I can see we get the error message login failed. In the website, it is also mentioned only letters and numbers are allowed. So what if we try to add some special characters and click on login. Now we get a different error message, illegal character in username or password. Let's check the source code of this web page and see if we can find some hidden information. So I'll right click and click on view page source. I can see I do not get much information. Let's try to log in and in this error page, let's try to check the source code by right clicking and clicking on view page source. So I can instantly see there's an inline JavaScript code that is doing some sort of authentication. So we have this filter function which will check whether our input is letter or number and then it takes our input. So this is the username I provided earlier and this is the password and then it will check our input against this filter function and store it in these two variables username filter passed and password filter passed. Next we can see we have a if else statement if the username filter passed and the password filter passed there is this another function check password which will check the password against our username if the username and password passed it will say login successful else login failed and if the filter does not pass we will get the illegal character in username or password this is the error message we saw earlier now i can instantly notice we do not have this function defined so this must be loaded from external script if i scroll up i can see we have an external script loaded secure.js so if I click on this file, I can see the check password function, which is taking the username and password. So if the username is admin and the password is this one, the result is true or else it is false. So this is the correct username and password. Let's try to log in with these credentials. In the username, I'll type admin. In the password, I'll copy this and paste it and click on login. And I can see we found the flag. So this was a very simple challenge. We're going over the web exploitation CTF challenges from Pico CTF. So if you want to see more of these challenges, please subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much for watching.